Hey, howdy, hey. So in a previous video, I was talking about uh, wanting to get some sort of like trans identifying clothing or something so that I could kind of subtly communicate to other queer people that like I was part of the community. Um, and I got this thing, look at this. Look at this thing that I got. It's a little pendant. That's the symbol for transgender. Um, I don't usually wear necklaces, but uh, I like this. So it's pretty, pretty spiffy. Pretty spiffy. So yeah, and I'm going to a new place tonight that I've never been to before, so uh, maybe this will help me make some more queer friends, because that's always a good thing. The thing I'm going to is another poetry slam that I found, actually. I, I go to these poetry nights down in Lowell every other week, and uh, I finally found one that's closer to my location that I'm going to be able to go to, so I'm really excited about that. I really like going to poetry nights, despite the fact that I haven't actually, like, written or performed any poetry. Uh, maybe I'll do that at some point, but for now I just really like listening. So yeah, anyway, I haven't really been up to much lately besides moving. I've kind of just been waiting around, um, waiting to hear back from the radio workshop that I applied to, and I'm not going to hear back from them for another two weeks. Um, so I've had some time on my hands. And of course, having a lot of time on your hands can be a very dangerous thing, for me at least, because it can lead to me feeling like I'm not getting anything accomplished. So I figured out a few things that I can do to actually help me feel like I'm accomplishing something while I'm waiting to hear back. Number one, making food. Making food is great because there are so many recipes out there that you can try. You can cook stuff, you can bake stuff. I tried making sushi that one time, uh, I tried it again and got a little better at it, and at the end of it you have this thing, you have like this physical thing that you made th that hopefully tastes delicious. Number two, learn a song. I might be biased because I was a music major, but I think that playing music is kind of one of the best things in the world. When you learn a song, you're developing a skill, which always feels good, and you're listening to a song that you like over and over again, because that's how you learn it. Hopefully, you're learning a song that you like. Um, and then you're, like, uh, figuring it out. You're figuring it out on your own. And that feels good. That makes you feel good about yourself because, like, you're doing this thing. So that's great. And then number three, something I just started doing again this week, is running. So I was on the track team for a year in high school, but it was mostly because I just wanted to hang out with the girls who were on the track team. I was never really good, and I continue to have, like, extremely bad endurance. So I never really thought that, like, I could, like, be a runner. Um, like, the person who just, like, goes out and, and runs in the morning just for fun. Um, but I've done that for the past three mornings, and it's made me feel good. What? What? Yeah, so I'm gonna keep doing it. After we moved here, I noticed that our neighbors are runners. They have, like, a 13.1 sticker on their car, and I've, I've been seeing them go out for runs every morning, and I was like, that's pretty cool. Um, and then, uh, Chase uploaded a video about starting running, um, which was just really great because he was, like, really into it. I guess I'll link that below. Um, and so I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna frickin', I'm gonna frickin' do it, I'm gonna try it, and if I don't like it, then I can stop. Um, but, yeah, it's, like, really great. Granted, I am only running, like, half a mile right now, and then, like, walking back for half a mile, because that's how bad my endurance is, but hopefully I'll be able to get that up. I don't know. We'll see. So that's kind of what I've been doing. Hopefully, if you're in a slump, you might be able to use these tips to, to get you going again, get you working again, get you feeling good again. Um, cause I'm feeling good again. Man, that feels so good. It feels really good. Um, so I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye!